And we're here with uh, Roger Pope, who just got done uh, speaking and prophesying over our congregation. Roger, how are you doing today? Hey, I'm doing, I'm blessed, man. Just blessed. Awesome day. Awesome day. Thank God just uh, really moved and did some extreme things in people's lives today. Definitely. Now, was that the message you came in with? What you, what you no, noticed? that was, you know, he always does that. He just shifts shit, dumps the wheelbarrow out and says, go with it. And so I, I had a message when I got up there and God just totally shifted everything. So, you know, and I think that's when you hear the voice of God, you got to run with it. So. Absolutely. So you said you took a trip around the week. What was your, what was your impression of the town? What did you think? Um, I, I just really see and uh, uh, what God's showing me about this town is there's, there's so much potential in this town that just hasn't been ignited, hasn't been let out. And uh, God's going to do something very special in this town. This town's going to be shaken in all different areas, in economic, physically, spiritually, mentally. I mean, a lot of good things fixing to happen in this town. Very cool, very cool. Um, you've had a little interaction with the people. What do you think about the people in Moigua? Awesome, man. I tell you what, this, this is a great place, great churches. I mean, the people that, that was here this morning, I, I couldn't ask for no better. I don't think I've been anywhere in the world that feel just the atmosphere of friendliness and excitement that's in the air here. Definitely, definitely. So, um... You're spending a lot of time around the Decatur area. How long do you expect to stay? Um, well, that's up to the Lord, actually. Um, you know, I know we'll be back after the first of the year to crank up meetings and stuff in the city and working with all the pastors and everything. Uh, I'm, I'm looking probably we'll be around uh, probably mid, mid part of the year. Uh, we'll be moving in and out and you know traveling because we still work all you know all over the, the heartland. But yeah, there's something big going to happen here in this region. And uh, I really believe that uh, God's going to really touch this, this region in such a mighty way that we got to just prepare for the, the wave that's coming, the tsunami wave of God's blessings, you know. Awesome, awesome. Uh, what do you think of our church? Oh, we man. just built this building not too long ago. This I is, like to get this a, is a blessing. This, this church is, is unreal. Out here in the middle of the cornfield, just, you know, driving down the road, you see this church and it's like, I mean, it's just like a lighthouse, you know, to a ship. Uh, and then the people that's in here. It just it makes the whole inside of the bracement the tear and the joy and everything it's incredible man. incredible great people any final words for our uh, congregation our town anything just want to encourage them that uh, God has great provision for this place and uh, looking forward to some good things that's going to come out of here looking for testimony thing but go out and just tell somebody about Jesus just love on somebody and just do something different and uh, be blessed <laughs>